What's going on? This is Johnny Vlogs. I'm here with this Pyrus. What's good, everybody? We are live. Grateful to be here. Thank you for all the support. We're getting on that thousand. Hopefully, next uh, I'll get to ten thousand, hundred thousand, a million, a billion. That'd be nice. So. We are at the Golden Corral. The first thing I'm going to be doing is we're going to be choosing a name in this. All of these names are in here. So we were going to be choosing it. So, and then let me show you the, before that, let me show you the Oakley double edges. That they are real. And this is what could be given out. Real authentic Oakley sunglasses, double edge. Look at that. Really cool stuff. So we put that in there. And then let's gonna have somebody special pick the name. It'll be freaking awesome. So here it is, right over here. John himself is gonna pick a name, guys. Woo! Let's see what we get. Da, 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 da. Drum roll, please. Close your eyes, pick the name. Okay, and the winner of the free pair of Oakleys is. Is it on the other side? There? Purple Haze. Purple Haze, you won the free pair of Oakley sunglasses. Let's go, good job, Purple This stuff Haze. right here. Sweet, congratulations, Purple Haze. You won a free pair of sung Oakley sunglasses. So comment, comment me, and so, yeah, that would be great. Let's hold that out. So, hey, people are live chatting. Yeah, they're live chatting. Let's see, there's Ashley Elmer, welcome. Let's see, we got... It's good. Let's see who else. Uh, don't count me because I was just looking at the straight to make sure it was working. Welcome and Mariah, to the awesome. <laughs> okay, so now we are going to be going to the the buffet itself. So it's the... you guys go and I will watch it. Do you want to hold it? Yeah, give me a second. Yeah, Got it. it just makes it strong for it. Okay, guys, we're going to be going to the Golden Corral. We're going to get the freaking awesome food. Let's go get the salad. Let's do this. It smells really good right now. Oh, yeah. Prime dinner time on a Monday. Someone said, Mariah said you made the best salads, Johnny. Thank you. Do you want to hold this? Yeah, I got it. Okay, let's get some salad. Gotta get my greens, you know? Gotta stay healthy. Yes, sir. That should be enough right there. Look at that. Let me go over here now. The creation has begun. Just a little pepperonis. Yes, sir. Let's 
see? We'll put a little mozzarella, why not, right? Now I'm gonna try the salad. So I'm gonna have this virus. He's gonna get his food now. Let's try some of this. Get some some of there. It's very crush. Yeah, give me a little bit more. There we go. Let's see the freaking let's see what we got. Ranch, blue cheese, Thousand Island. Uh, honey mustard. Oh, God bless. Thank you. I'm gonna have some of this Thousand Island right here. Yeah, I used to go to the old country buffet too in Mesa. That was a good one. That was before my they favorite. closed that one. Yeah, you could make a chocolate shake with the chocolate milk in there. That was the best thing ever, dude. Yeah. Now they use it for our food trucks. So. Alright. I'm gonna get some of these crackers. Yeah, those crackers. And then let's do some bacon. Yes, sir. Yeah, we did do that one when it was abandoned. I was gonna do, I was gonna make a video with it when it wasn't abandoned, but yeah, I wasn't that active on YouTube yet. We got some cheese, some cheese. cheddar cheese. And a mozzarella cheese. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful. You getting anything else over here? Any tuna? Uh, I did that last time. I think I'm good. Okay, let me get, I forgot to get some cottage cheese. I think I'm going to get some cheese. Get some cottage cheese right there. Cool. Alright. We're going to go and eat now. show you the dessert in a little bit so but let's go let's go back and eat some food yeah let me actually go over here this is what I got look at that it's the good stuff Crackers. Oh, the crackers, yeah, this is what he got right there. Look at that. Looks very yummy. Uh, maybe not the bacon. <laughs> yeah, everything else. <laughs> so. Let's do one more real quick. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Cracking the crackers. Yes, sir. Alright. You got as good, got his utensils out. Utensils. Utensils. <laughs> Ten thousand. Okay. We got Thousand Island dressing on that. Look yes, at that. sir. Mm. What is that? That is good. It's really That's good. Good salad, yeah. That's cool. Um, when they rate it. Um. Is it cold? Yeah, yeah. It's cold. Nice. Um. I mean, it's not like like my like homemade, but I'd say seven out of ten, maybe. Seven out of ten. Okay. Sweet. I'm gonna try mine now. This is what I got. Look at that. Got the pepperonis. I got the cheese. I got the salad. I got ranch. I got uh, cottage cheese. Got all the good stuff. Let me try this. See how it tastes. Uh, 
I don't need a knife for this. I just need the fork. Okay, let me put a pepperoni. Look at that. This looks really good. I do need napkins, so. Which is pretty good. I like it. Salads are always good, a 9 out of 10. Really, really good. It's good stuff, good food. Oh. We do, might do a, like, a buffet tour. You know, go to the Comment down below and tell me what you think. I think that'd be nice. Go and uh, go to Las Vegas and do some live buffet Vegas things over there. They got a lot of good buffets so, over there. Yeah. So. But, yeah, it's, it's a good area. Looks like it's gonna rain outside. Maybe. I look at the clouds. It's hard. It's hard to see on the screen because you know, it's so uh, light. Like, look at it. It's hard to see. Let me walk over there. Oh yeah, we're good. Look at that. That's outside. Looks like it's getting darker outside. It looks like it's raining down there. It's supposed to get very windy outside, so it's kind of interesting. Oh, you skipped the salad. But yeah, looks like somebody went straight for dinner. The main course. So look at that. He got the corn. You got the carrots, you got the shrimp. Purple, shrimp, and you got the mashed potatoes, and you got the the mushrooms. Yes. And you know what I also heard now? Because they have the butterfly shrimp now, and they also mm. have chicken tenders. I'm excited about the chicken tenders. Hopefully they still have it. So, But he's going to try it, see how it tastes. Well, the mushrooms were good so far. Well, you already ate a mushroom? Yes, it's delicious. That's good. Want me to eat another one just to probe it? Sure. Mm. <laughs> Let me have one of the shrimps. We got the butterfly shrimp. Mm. Nice and hot. Nice and hot? Compared to the last place we were in. That's cool. Yeah. A big difference. Yeah, yeah. A little heat helps out. Then you also have some corn. He, he loves his butter on the corn. You can't have corn without butter. Yep. Put some butter on the corn. Some, put some butter on the potatoes, and then that should be good. Oh, what is he munching? Uh, this questions. <laughs> oh, what am I munching? I was no, I don't know. Somebody asked that, but I'm not sure when, when it was or who's asking. Or who they're asking about. So his dad just ate him. So ate him a mushroom and then he ate some shrimp. And now he's now he's gonna try the corn with He's some putting butter on everything. Butter and, and mushrooms. You're probably buttering up the You would probably put butter on mushrooms too, right? No. <laughs> Don't be a smarty. <laughs> Let's try the uh, carrots. I can't see it, can't see Oh, now I can see. Carrots are good for the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Mm. And I went out the mashed potatoes and corn. Potatoes are good. Now we'll try the corn. And the corn. You hardly can mess up corn. You can, but yeah. hardly. <laughs> it's very good. Butter makes everything it's taste It's a matter hard. of heat, too. What yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna try more of the salad. Because I, mean, I got salad. Other, I have to eat day, it. it was frozen. Where were you guys at the other day? We went to the other day, too. Chicken. <laughs> More of it is good. Yeah, it's good. I love the seasoning. They're the. Mm. 
So yeah, this is my first time of hopefully many um, videos that I go live on. So let me eat a little bit. Let me eat some more of my salad, you know. And it, were you interested in like later on after like dessert or something, we could do like competition or something like that? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Go live competition, see who wins. <laughs> I'm gonna smoke you. You probably will. Wait, wait, wait. What was it with the churro that you won last time? I knew it was the pudding. Oh, the pudding? Yeah. He actually won one? Yeah, I won yeah. one. Because the pudding was just, you know how pudding is. It was easy to eat quick. So I just ate it really quick and that's that's what happened. I won for the first time. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to to ask. Read them, so. Let me see. Let's see. You guys are awesome. Thank you very much, Brian. I'm curious. Is it on twenty dollars the... to eat there? It's like what? Uh, it's like seventeen something. So, um, a little bit so less. about twenty dollars with the drink. So, but, are you answering the people back over there? Yeah, I was just I was just looking on the making sure the live is still going. Yeah, is there any more? Uh, yeah, any more questions? There and you can answer questions if there's any questions that can be answered. Mm. If you guys download the app, I think you get, I think it's like $10 or something like that, or a free drink or something like that, but, but if you get 100 points, like if you come here a few times, you get 100 points, you get $10 off your bill, which is pretty good, so, but yeah, I think I have to go and crowd to eat. Um, I know yours is a sweet potato pie. Yeah, the sweet potato. Me? Oh boy. Um, so Purple Haze won the the Oakleys. Purple Haze. Purple so Haze. Is that his real name in the back? I just you don't want to reveal it. No, no, is that it. his real name in the back? Yeah, that's that's okay. the the thing. Purple okay. Haze. So I want to make sure we don't lose it. Well, what were you going to say, Miss um, Pyrus? I was going to say maybe the mac and cheese. Actually, the pizza is good. No, the pasta. I'm going to put it in the, the pasta place. with the sauce. Well, the pasta with when it has a lot of cheese. No, with the cheese and the sauce. That's good. That's the best, like the long noodles. Yeah. Put it in the box. So we won't lose it for later. Make sure the person gets it because we have to box it and mail it. I'm almost I'm getting there, close to bringing out my salad so I can get. The main dish. The only thing I had today was the cereal. I think that's about it. Do you have anything for lunch this far? Uh, kind of a breakfast. Uh, what was it? I bought some uh, raisin like uh, cinnamon like bread. And yeah, I had yeah. some. Um, Cream cheese. Interesting. It was good. Really good. Thank you. I appreciate it. Reaching a thousand. Took me forever. It says, this virus, what else did you do today? What else did I do today? I just sat and actually watched Across the Spider-Verse. Finally, it's been what, like, I think it's been one or two years since that movie came out or something. At least like a year or so, and I didn't watch it till finally. Yeah. And uh, the ending, uh, not gonna spoil it, but it's crazy. It's a good movie. 
That's cool. Yeah. Is that a Spider Verse? Yeah, across the Spider Verse. The first one was into the Spider Verse. The second one's Spider Man across the Spider Verse. Yeah. Yeah. But I was also. Is it interdimensional? Yeah, it goes through like a ton of dimensions. Like there's different Spider Man from all the universes, uh, all the multiverses. He meets his fan Spider Man too? Uh, no. The villain actually. The Superman did that. He met the bad Superman? No. Well, I mean, technically you could say the main Spider-Man, who's the leader of all the Spider-Man, isn't a good guy. Because he, he pulls a he pulls a Scarlet Witch, but actually gets what he wants because he, he breaks a candid event by living in a life where his version of himself died. Mm -hmm. yeah. So he had like a family. Mm -hmm. So you could say he's a villain, <laughs> even though he's a Spider-Man, because he... He took someone's place, someone was supposed to, so he like broke a canon event, which is like an event that's supposed to happen. Yeah. But, yeah, that movie was pretty good. And then I remember Burger King, I think I had, it was so stupid, they had like a freaking shake, or not a shake, like a, like the ice cream. It was like a, it was like a McFlurry, oh. whatever oh, from it was. Kenda. And it, all they did was put like, it was kind of like really small, like, uh, what are they yeah, called? Wasn't uh, it the new uh, Kung, Kung Fu Panda thing? No, I'm talking about when Spider-Verse came out. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. They had like, they had like a, they had like a, whatever their version of a big flurry, like, they had like ice cream and all they put were like these, uh, Captain Crunch, like, blue and red, like, small berries on the top of it, like, weird cereal. It wasn't even that good. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't have the burger, though. But did your dad rate the food yet? What did you What did you rate that food over there? Uh, I say uh, a nine. A nine out of ten. Very nine. hot. Nine was good. It's pretty hot. Yeah. Nice. That's cool. That's a good rating. Yeah, that is a good rating. Ten is the best though. Very few places get a ten. I think if you're making a video, the only exception would have to be, uh, I don't know the exact restaurant name, but Gordon Ramsay's Kitchen. If oh. you didn't give him a 10, he'd probably be pissed. <laughs> That's too bad. Looks like I ate my food pretty good on there, so. The only place I've ever had a 10 was in uh, Bahamas. When I ate steak dinner in the Bahamas. Nice. Yeah, the... Yeah, when I, they lit it on fire and everything. I wish those lava, soft, not lava, the, the dirt cakes, the Oreo delicious. dirt cakes were bigger. I wish they were bigger. Yes. So, are you all ready? Hold on, I'm almost done. Nice. Uh -oh. Don't wear the clothes. I made a, no, I made a mess on the oh, table, not the clothes. Here. There we go, I was wondering where those were. about time to get the main course the main food it's gonna be freaking awesome and i'm gonna get some chicken tenders because i love chicken tenders hopefully they have them here if they're supposed to in the butterfly shrimp the two new things i see in the commercial well, the so i'm gonna try it and hopefully if i get the chicken tenders that they're not they're not hard so but yeah let's uh y'all ready to go to spiris let's do it i got you guys I'm trying to see a live food challenge, somebody says. <laughs> yeah, well, you'll get one. I'm a win. Guaranteed bet on me. Don't bet too much money, though. Somebody says, have you got the serve? The workers to make it the Aki. What does Aki way mean? Johnny way? What's Johnny way? I don't know. There's a chef. What's good? We're live. Is that? We're live? Yeah, we're yeah, live. live. Yeah. Say hi. Hello. What's good? <laughs> he makes the good stuff over here. Yeah, this is the real chef. Yes. Sir. yes. What do you guys need? Uh, steak? Yeah, some steak and everything, pretty much. Yeah. 
You don't want any back of your truck. Oh, okay, never mind, I'm happy. <laughs> I got some steak over here. Yeah. Medium perfect. Oh, thank you. you want some pan? Sure, that would be great. Yeah. Uh, well done. Thank you. Looks really good. Sausage? Uh, sure. Get it all in there, buddy. Exactly. That's why I got the two plates. Protein plate right there. Thank you. Let's see. You get some. Uh, Whoa! I don't remember those huge bottles of spice right there. Cornbread. That's crazy. Now, where are they hiding those chicken tenders? They have fried chicken. Let me, let me ask and see if they where they're hiding the chicken tenders. Hey, let's go. Oh, this, I think, uh, they got hot ones, too. Margarine, uh, mandarin orange ones. Oh, dude. We got to try all those. Nashville, I think I'll pass on the hot stuff. So, yeah, why not? Let me get a little, let me get the little one right here. Oh, and they got some mac and cheese, too. We get some of this stuff, too. You gotta always get the pasta. It's the best, best thing. Yeah. Okay, whoever keeps saying, ask the chef for the Johnny way, stop. <laughs> I think that was the most Johnny way we could get that. <laughs> Let's go over there and see what's over there. Do you want to do a cheerio contest? Let's do it. I'll put my stuff down over there and I'll come back. Gotta get two plates. Gotta get two. Yeah. That's pretty popular over there. The chicken tenders, so you go ahead and get that first. Alright, let's see. Yeah, chicken tenders. We got like one. Yeah, look at that. The mandarin orange one looks really good. I think you gonna get, get the one. hot one? Yeah, we're gonna get the hot one. You can see how too. hot it is in Nashville. I can smell how hot it is. Is that good? Is that? Is it look spicy? Oh yeah, that looks good. Nice. Let's see. Yeah, we gotta get the famous uh, baked spaghetti. Yeah, the best part of the meal. 
Yeah. Here, you want to move so he can get... Oh, sorry. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Gotta get all the cheese in there. Good stuff. Are you getting the mac and cheese too? Yeah, yeah. Nice. Cheese right there. Cheesy, cheesy. That's a lot of cheese. Too much cheese. Yeah. Oh man, you forgot the sweet potato pie. Oh. I, I need to get that. that. There's two left over here. I'm gonna try it myself, see how good it is. Cheese is really good. I think that's fish over there. It kind of looks like a volcano. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> Where is the sweet potato? Over there, down there. Sweet oh, potato. Down yeah. Do you guys have any uh, sweet potato? Do we have any who? Uh, sweet potato? Right over there. Oh, it's over there. Oh, we were over there oh, already. Okay. Yeah. Cool, thank you. Okay. I guess the sweet potatoes are down here somewhere. Do you see the sweet potatoes? I don't see it. Oh, he's, he's maybe thinking about the sweet potato itself. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I think that's big sweet potato, that right there. The other time they had it mashed. Maybe they switched it for the day. We can get the other stuff. So, what else are you going to get on it? This pyrus? Oh, yeah, you got to get the churros. Yeah, the churros. Over here. Let me get some churros. I think we're gonna have five. Yeah, five. Oh, and that beef, the taco beef is. If you ever, if you guys ever get the taco beef, it's very spicy. So I want to try it, unless you like very spicy. Stuff. He's probably over exaggerating. It's not that spicy. <laughs> it was to me. His his handle on spicy. Time to go back. Uh, you want to get a steak? Hey, you got a steak? What's <laughs> up, my dog? You got a steak? Yes, sir. Cool, thanks. This is what he got so far. Look at that. Got some steak right there. Looks so good. Here you go, buddy. Thank cool. you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Now it's time to eat. You see anything else, or or is that? I think that's probably good for right now. Okay. Unless I get more hungry. Okay. Let's go back. Oop. Time to go back. Then we're going to have a competition. Okay, guys. Did you want to do the competition first, or did you want to do it? Yeah, let's do it first. Okay, let me, uh... They overfilled my cup. Some of this stuff. Don't complain. No, it's Better to have too much than too little. <laughs> I, yeah. uh, Except when it comes to trouble. <laughs> okay, guys, we're going to be doing the churro challenge first. So, and then maybe we'll do another challenge for dessert. 
But we got the churros. They have the churros, not in the dessert aisle. I guess it's supposed to be at food. I mean, dinner. Mexican aisle. Dinner. <laughs> so, but yeah, we're gonna try it. And uh, yeah. Okay, one. I got one, two, three, four, five. And then you got one, two, three, four, five. Hold on, I move. So, are you guys ready? How do you want to do this? You want to like meet over here? Yeah. Yeah, let me move. All right, it's food challenge. I have these both in okay. the frame, so. Okay, you just Go do right a ahead. countdown or whatever. And so. Five, four, three, two, one, go! Don't make me laugh. Who the heck, you, don't have, you ate two already? I'm only on my second one. <laughs> Can't, you can't win. I can't compete with you this can't, guy. You right can't. Here. You can't. You knew he was going to win, probably. Unless a miracle occurs. I told right? you I was going to smoke you. The heck? I look over there. One is. How? Did he finish them all? Yeah. Yeah. How, they're you, gone. Oh. Can you tell me what your secret is? He beat is? you fair can you, and square. Can you tell me what your secret, your secret is? Uh. I, um, I don't know. My my dad says it's because he was he had a mission, a church mission on Fort Knox, so they would eat really fast because he oh. was there. So I kind of just was bored with it. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. Yeah, they said, "Let's go, Johnny." I could see. Yeah, it's, it was kind of late. You said, "Let's go, Johnny." <laughs> it's kind of yeah. late. He said that right as we ended. Maybe we'll have a pudding competition or something like that later. We gotta do ice cream. Or ice cream. I'm gonna. You get... just want to do pudding, so you you might go win this time, boy. Yo. I might get a brain freeze if I have ice cream, but we could do the ice cream thing too. So, but uh, let's. You, you gotta eat your food. Yeah, we, yeah, we gotta eat the food. food. We'll they did not have any sweet potatoes, so unfortunately, we, I wanted to try the sweet potato pizza, but they didn't have any. We're going to have this pirates go first. Oh, let's, let's do it. You know, I'm going to do something even crazier. Since we don't have sweet potatoes, we have next the best next potato. So, mashed potatoes. Yeah. I'm going to try that. Mashed potatoes on your pizza. With the gravy. With the gravy. You can't, you can't have that without gravy. Weird food combination, but why not? We're gonna need a ton of napkins. Oh yeah. Okay, just let me know how it tastes. The cheese, the potatoes, that's good. The sauce, I don't think I like the sauce on this pizza though. What's the sauce taste like? Eh, it's not that good. Yeah. I'm gonna put some more potato on my crust real quick. He's gonna try the other stuff too. Alright, I'm just gonna finish your walk in. I want to let you guys all know you guys freaking rock. You guys are rock stars. So, rock on, guys. All right, it's steak time. Now we're all right, here we go. Potato. Let's see the steak. That guy was Don't the Don't make a mistake. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's top tier steak right there. It's uh, okay. well cooked. That guy did such a good job. He was a good guy. Delicious. That was the best guy I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> ten of a ten. <laughs> I don't want to ask any more questions. Oh no, well we went we went we went live and the chef was like cooking yeah, it. Yeah, he was doing good, huh? Yeah. yeah. He's the best chef. Yeah. How about try the mandarin orange? Oh yeah, let's try the spicy. At least he wasn't right a here. shifty that's, chef. That's the the Nashville chicken one. Hot, yeah, the hot stuff. Ooh, hot. Hmm, it's more tangy than it is spice. Yeah. Is it hot at all? 
Oh, not really. I'm testing it. Hold on. Well, you got to wait sometimes. It takes a moment to burn. Yeah, sometimes it takes... Mm, my mouth is like... Decently like... Mm, I rate the spice like... It's not that high like... Mm, maybe a little bit higher than the hot and spicy from McDonald's. Actually... Mm, the hot and spicy is like three. I'd rate this like a five out of ten. Like spice is not that spicy. So yeah. it's not burning. No. Good. I did feel my mouth a little bit like flaky. Tingling. Does it change the taste of your mouth? Yeah. No, no, not that much. So here's the here's the Mandarin scorch chicken. Yeah. Looks very soft. Mm -hmm. Is, it, is soft? it warm? What? Is it hot? Warm or hot? Mm, more warm. That's good. The sauce on that was delicious. All right, it's time for the pasta. We pasta gotta get, We gotta get huh. some cheese in there. Your favorite, di your favorite, uh, favorite dish here. Yeah. Mmm. The cheese, the sauce. Oh, there's freaking meat right here. Hold on. <laughs> oh, don't want to miss the meat. <laughs> don't. <Yes. laughs> the meat is the meat is the best part. Yeah, the meat's good. So the cheese is good. The sauce is good. It's delicious. Actually, better sauce than the pizza. <laughs> you got the mac and cheese now. Now the mac and mac. cheese. <laughs> can you show the food close? It's really blurry. Now we could try that. Maybe it's like the Wi-Fi, but we can... Keep it on um, 480p. Don't go any higher than that. That's probably why it's blurry. Because any other high, high free and pixelated food is just going to be... Not very good. From the quality. How's that? Is that a little better? Hmm. It's not homemade mac and cheese, but it's good. I read the food. Oh boy. You can go on with my phone and do the same thing he's doing and watch it. I'm gonna say. I want to say give the same rating Johnny's dad did. Ten, nine out of ten. That was a good food. Hmm. Yes. Delicious. The chicken, the mashed potatoes, the steak. That was the best. Glad you loved it. Wait. You see, I didn't even see the brown sauce. I would have got brown sauce, too. I like that for the potatoes. Yeah, the gravy? Yeah, it was good. Did you taste the brown sauce? How does it taste? It tastes good. Good? Yeah. Yep. Just like homemade. Now I think this verse is doing it on purpose. They keep saying one out of ten how Aki is. Like, come on, dude. <laughs> I know you're probably doing that on purpose. I sub because of Black Bear Diner. What's good, Razor Hawk? What be beverage are you drinking? Johnny's got lemonade. The Don, yeah, I'm going to call it the Don His Coke. And I've got root beer. <laughs> Someone says roar. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna try my food, guys. Oh, you want me? Oh, you want me to hold it? Yeah. That'd be easy. I probably won't hear you. Here, I got it. Okay. Oh, Aki is a famous YouTube chef. Okay. Okay, this is what I got. As you can see here, I got the macaronis and cheese. I got this stuff right here. Um, let's see what else. And I also got chicken tenders. And I got the cornbread. I got the steak. And I got the ham. So let me. Uh, Excuse me, let me try it and see how it tastes. Try the... Gonna, try the... I'm gonna try the, the steak first. I oh, no, they don't have chocolate milk here, unfortunately. Yeah, it's a bummer. Okay, let me try the steak. Let's see how this tastes. Hmm? 
Razorcock says hello, Johnny, and everybody watching. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> With this mouth stuff. <laughs> to eat first. <laughs> the steak is not bad. It tastes pretty good. It's not like a Texas Roadhouse steak. Right? No, it's not yeah. going to be that good. Also not as expensive, thank, thank goodness. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna try the mandarin orange chicken. Wait, is that one with the sauce? With the oh, sauce, you got one yeah. without the sauce. Got one with that, with the sauce, two with the sauce, and one without the sauce. We're gonna try this one. Julia asks, "How do you like your steak cooked?" Um, medium. Medium. Medium is good. But it's well done, it's, yeah, it's not, you don't get the flavor if it's well done, so. How's the, how's the chicken? The chicken is, it's okay, I felt, I felt a little hard spot, what the, is that supposed to be like that? What, what, uh, ripped off or what? No, no, like uh, pink like that or whatever, is it supposed to be like that? I don't know. Here, let me, let's what do you guys think? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Like that. It's a little pink. Should I eat this more? What do you guys think? Or is that just, is that just veins or something of the chicken? Yeah, it's probably just a chicken. We're probably fine. Okay. I hope I don't die from this. You're not gonna so, die. But yeah, <laughs> let me try a little more. This part over here is the hard part. This part. Let me try. Let me try this stuff right here. We got the. Wait, did you? You didn't. Wait, did you want to try the rest on that plate? Yeah, let's do. Let's do uh, the ham. Try a little ham. The ham looks good. This is what the ham looks like. Hmm. My ham tastes really good. It's good ham. It's kind of hard to mess up ham. <laughs> True. And this sausage thing right here is supposed to be a little spicy, so I'm going to try a little bit of it. Okay, let me try this. See what it looks like, guys? It's pretty good. But I gotta drink lemonade because you can feel at the beginning it's like you can't feel anything like the spice, but then all of a sudden just like pops all over in your mouth that you don't get spicy. So I gotta try some lemonade. Did you do a video of those uh, space Oreos, the one with the, yeah, yeah. the Pop Rocks? <laughs> yep. Were those good? Yeah, it wasn't bad. Yeah. Let me try the cornbread. You should have met a new food since the new food combo since I know I'm sweet potato. But I did freaking mashed potatoes and pizza. The best cornbread is from Boston Market. That's the best cornbread. I'm going to see if this compares. Golden Corral versus Boston Market. Let's see who wins. Boston Market just beats it just by a little bit. This doesn't taste that bad. It's better than other places. But I think the worst cornbread to get cornbread is at Cracker Barrel. That doesn't like, no. But this is pretty close to uh, Boston Market, so. Okay, I'm gonna try this stuff now. The mac and cheese and this. Uh, the pasta. The pasta, yeah. Pasta first. It's kind of like a pasta pizza because you have the cheese in there. They don't have the bread, but. Oh. When I went to KFC and when I had the cheese. Oh, yeah. Pizza, the the cheese. $13 for the meal. That was even that big. I saw it, was, it like it was, it's not worth it. It was very small. 
and it wasn't worth $13. You can go to Olive Garden, just for a little bit more, you can get a better deal. So, so let me try this. cheese is super delish. Kind of has that taste of like a Peter Piper pizza. I mean, not Peter Piper, of a Pizza Hut pizza, the cheese. Oh, yeah. Just a little bit, yeah. Do yeah. you agree? Yeah. I'm gonna try the mac and cheese now. Uh, someone asked, uh, y'all ever eat at local John's or just chain restaurants? Um... Sometimes I do, but usually those places, there's like one place, what was it called? It's over by a post office. I forgot what it's called, but like they're like very expensive. They're like 20 something dollars like for like a small burger. Very expensive, so. But I mean, most of I do chain foods and stuff. I heard there's the Bojangles coming to Arizona too, so that'd be interesting to try. Bojangles? Yeah, like Mr. Bojangles. Like the clown? No, he's, a, he's not a clown. He's Joker. a pool guy. Bojangles? Yes. Sounds yes. like the name of a clown. Uh, no. Yeah, so. Mr. Bojangles. Dang. I'll have a. Uh, Look up the song sometime. It's a really nice one. Wait, so, did, yeah, I would probably. You gotta try, wait, did you try the mac and cheese? Yeah, mac and cheese was pretty good. I'll probably rate this whole thing out of a 10, probably a 7 out of 10. Probably like the chicken, the mandarin chicken could be a little bit softer. What I bit into, I thought I bit into a bone, but I didn't. But, but still, I don't want to, you know. But yeah, 7 out of 10. So, but yeah. I'm gonna have this virus. Wait, I already did my food. Eat more. Oh, yeah, eat Why, more. Who wants to watch me eat food? Just kidding. So. But, yeah, what's. Uh, are you gonna try and mix anything together? I wish I had another. Like, pizza put some slice. mac and cheese on the. and that stuff? What, like the mashed potatoes? Oh, yeah. Actually, I'm gonna try out. You should give it a shot. I'm gonna try this. We'll try the pasta and the freaking mac and cheese. I don't know, somebody said it's B.O. time. What does that mean? Bad of body odor? Yes. I don't know. B.O. is body What's B.O. time? I have no idea. It's whatever. That's funny. How's that manager an orange thing? Good, good. What would you say the best one, the best thing is on there? This steak, for sure. Oh, a steak right there, yeah. I want you to get the mac and cheese and put bacon bits on it. What? I'm not going all the way out there just for bacon bits. <laughs> I mean, that would be, be a good idea. Somebody said, no oh, Bojangles. Bo time, not B.O. Bo oh. time, Bojangles time. Bojangles, yeah. Mr. So, what would you say your favorite thing to get dessert wise here? Oh boy. Um, let me think. I don't know. Oh. I don't have a favorite. What about the cupcakes? Do you like those cupcakes? I mean, maybe the carrot cake. Yeah. You okay, stop create... talking about hockey. I don't know who that is. It's a, <laughs> it's a YouTube chef. I've never seen him before. I don't know the... Stop talking about it. No, Aki, you know, like octopus, but like O C O C K Y, Aki. That's a YouTube chef. Here's some napkins over there. Bro, Thanks. stop. <laughs> what? He keeps oh. saying that, Aki, dude. 
for trying more of that steak. Oh my god. He says he makes cool and crazy foods. That's cool. I might have heard of him before. Maybe. He seems like I might know him. Johnny would like the Aki way. Would love the Aki way. Simply combine some fun foods. Maybe. Simply combine some fun foods. Let me try. On the ham right here, let me try ham with. Ham with a churro. Let me try ham with a churro. Let me try that. Here, let me see. Mm. Oh, you're on the you're on the browser page. You got to be on the app. Oh, the app. Okay. Because if it was a browser, it would have mm. its own like extension. That's pretty good. The ham and uh, churro together. Ew, you tried the ham and the churro? Yeah. That doesn't work. <laughs> I thought you said ham and mac and cheese. No, no, a ham and churro is pretty good. What? What are you going to try next? That's weird, bro. Uh, yeah, I have some pasta left. I'm trying on this steak. Pasta with steak. How is that? I think there's some fat on this steak. It's probably not the best steak, you know. Yeah, it's pretty good. Dirty nachos would be so good. I've never heard of dirty nachos. Great. Ham with the churro is hockey. Dude, stop. <laughs> what? I guess I'm obsessed with saying hockey. Make dirty not there are no way. They don't have tortilla chips here, do they? I think they do. They do? Yeah. It's, it's, it, they say make dirty nachos. What is that? I have no idea. Why though? <laughs> I don't even know what dirty nachos is. Me neither. Uh, yes, thank you. Uh, can you give me lemonade? Oh, uh, sure. Sure, I'll take more lemonade. Thank you, appreciate it. You want to record a little more? Okay. Excuse me. Oh, wait. What? Uh, okay, dirty nachos is nachos with a lot of fun toppings. Perhaps beefier and cheesier and Cheetos. Nachos the Aki way. No, not you two. Colby, Colby and frickin' Moat Lice Maker are over here. Aki, shut up. You silly gooses. Let's try more now. Good now. Oh, apparently Mike Will is the one that came up with dirty nachos. Mike oh. Will. Yeah, oh. I don't know who that is. Chicken tenders taste pretty good. It's okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Or the cornbread. But stay tuned. We're going to have dessert here shortly. He wants to do a pudding challenge rematch. Well, I do. We'll give that a try. So. If you guys have any rematch... Uh, suggestions on what kind of dessert competition we should do let us know in the comments hey boss man you want to hold this i got it yes while we finish i was too busy worried about his flipping but i got a neck I looked at your face <laughs> I guess yeah. no one says sees the dog's face on this. Yeah, I got it. The writing. Mm. Let's see. Let's 
Beefy, people are writing in the comments. Big beefier bull. Where's that? Big beefier bull. I never heard of that. Good to see you. I think live. they're talking about the very nacho stove. So what? somebody's happy to see you because they said, "Good to see you." They said Johnny. Yes, that's him. Um, and then putty challenge with cupcake and case inside the hockey wick. Dude, speak English. So a cupcake inside the pudding? We have to eat both. Cupcake inside the pudding? Why? Usually the pudding would be inside the cupcake, not the other way around. Huh. Otherwise, you'd have the cupcake floating on the pudding. Juliet says, I'm going to have to go to Golden Cross tonight. You probably should. <laughs> it is good. If you don't live that far away, it's good stuff. Try more of that steak. I want to see a Johnny versus this Pyrus crab leg eating challenge. I'm sorry, but I'm not a seafood oh, guy. Good. Okay. It's medium. I don't do seafood unless it's fish sticks. Oh, come on. You see food, you eat it. <laughs> That's different. I'm not. I'm talking about fish food. I don't eat fish. I don't so eat what? things from the ocean. You don't eat uh, shrimp? No. The only exception to that is red, red lobster, lobster pizza. Crabs? Oh, red lobster one time. I think when I went there last, we had like that like puff breaded shrimp or something, like the cheap deal that going on on Tuesdays or whatever it was. I can't remember. I always get a young lobster around there. There we go. Charge it up a little more. What? Someone said, hey, chill, old man. Don't call him an old man. Cheddar biscuit challenge? Cheddar biscuit. Someone said shrimp wrong. They spelled it scrimp. <laughs> it's a scrimp. More steak. Don't make a mistake. <laughs> have a steak. Oh, that's the pun I was going to make. I have a steak in this channel, food challenge. That's it. Mm -hmm. What are you doing with that? You answered somebody on the phone? Uh, yeah. Can't go wrong with a lemonade. That is true. That's really good. You want to cheers? 2,000 subs. Woo! And many, Let's many go. more. Next goal is 10,000, then 100,000, then a million, then a billion, then a trillion, then octillion. Sextillion? Sextillion. Just keep going on and on and on and on. Have people from uh, other planets subscribe to my channel. <laughs> like aliens, that'd be tight. Right? Yeah, you're crazy. What do you think this is Star Wars? Yeah. You want the Greys to come and watch your show? Yeah, I want them to join me. It's like it's like that episode of Rick and Morty where all the, the alien heads oh, yeah. come together and they like they watch the Earth. What do you what do you guys think of them doing some Rick and Morty uh, you know skits? You know, uh, clean. Clean Rick and Morty. Clean Rick and Morty skits. That's okay. hard, but I can do it. <laughs> okay, he's gonna. He's really good at it. I did a video a long time ago, but he's going to do Rick and Morty. Are you serious? Right here in front of everybody. Can you speak sure, a little Rick and Morty? Yeah, what? Can, can you speak a little Rick and Morty? Yeah, you can do a lot of it. It's been a little bit, but um. All right, I got this. Ready? All right. Ah, <clears throat> oh, jeez, Rick, where'd you take it this this time? I don't know, Morty. Uh, great Golden Crown. I think I was drunk while we were driving the spaceship. 
<laughs> Jeez, Rick, I told you how much I hate buffets and messes on my stomach. Oh, fine. Morning, we don't have to come. <laughs> I like it. Nice. Very good. Do you have any others? Uh, why, any other voices? Do you, have, do you have more voices? Yes. Okay. Uh, let me finish my food first. Yes, eat some food. Oh, Enjoy your food. life. You got all that food and you only finished one plate? Wait, you didn't even finish one plate. I mean, here a little there, here a little there. I don't think you can take it home. <laughs> I don't know, I don't take it home. In a shopping basket. <laughs> Oh, I've never seen this many people. Oh, great. They want us to do impressions of each other. I can't do that. I can't do an impression of Johnny. I'm sorry. I can. You want me to try you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, guys. I'm Jeremiah. <laughs> that just sounds like Rick. <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> I got a Yankees hat on and a Yankees lanyard on. This makes me sound like a smoker. Hey, I've been smoking for 50 years. <laughs> I don't want you to die. I hope don't fall over and die. At <laughs> oh, we don't want to have to have a medical team here live. I can probably, there's, I can do a New Yorker. Do a New Yorker, okay? Go to 33, yeah, 33. Go to 3rd Street. I'm New York, I come from New York. Who part like of New York are you from? I'm from Brooklyn. Brooklyn, I'm right that. here, I love Brooklyn. There's no problem with that. Uh, Holsey Street, you ever live on Holsey yeah, Street? Yeah, I did, man. Yeah, I used to live on Holsey Street. Yeah. <laughs> you, you gotta do the voice right. I'm the Don. I made up a name for the Don. His name is Don Mikey Co Corleone. Michael. You call me Mikey Corleone. I used to Michael. go to the storefronts. You know the storefronts? Yeah, Where the we hang out? You know what I mean? You get your men that you need to do some work for you? You send them out there, you yeah. make them do exactly what they do. They kiss the ring, they, of my ring. Yes, they go out and they put a flower in somebody's shirt and you know it's all over. You there. know they mark for death. <laughs> <laughs> Me and the Don over here like the joke, we put people in cement shoes. Oh, yeah. yes, yes, yes. They reach the bottom fast, you know what I mean? <laughs> No, we try to be nicer than that. We're not like that for real. No, not for real. No. Well, we, I knew people who were like that for real. And I'm sorry to say, I tried to keep away from that. I mean, they all, you could make money, but doing things that you really don't want, you'd be sorry you did. Okay, you ready to go get some dessert? Hold on. It's time to eat some dessert. <laughs> Somebody says, does your dad have mob ties? <laughs> hey, what's your name? You better watch out. <laughs> you better watch out. That's the dog right there. Kiss the ring. <laughs> There's but, no turning back once you... Like they say in the Godfather, you kiss the ring, you don't kiss the ring of the dog. You came to me on the day of my daughter's wedding asking me for a favor. Do you want to wake up with a horse in your bed? Or this you the really head? <laughs> just, it's just the ho head, this horse's head, it's horse. <laughs> your favorite horse, your favorite sleeping horse with you. <laughs> Someone said wise guy. Wise guy. Yeah, we had wise guys. Wise sure. guy. Yeah. Yeah. The wise guys take care of people like you. <laughs> All right. You're gonna go get some uh, fun stuff. There's some dessert. You taking this with you for the zoo? Yeah. 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 Here you go. I'll wait here. Watch your jump. Okay. Let's go get some dessert. Let's do it. Let's go over here. Let's go get a plane. Let's get two. 
Eggs buzz, man. Where'd you want to go first? Let's start at the beginning. Let's get some more smell. Did you, did you chew here? And when you chew on yours? Did Do you it. chew on yours? So now we, we have a marshmallow competition. Or I could just fill yours up for you. Did you tell me what you... What? You're just gonna lose. You. You're just gonna lose that you competition. Want a rice treat. Yeah, you put one on there, boss. Okay. I'll get you a rice. Oh, oh shoot. You... <laughs> Sorry. We'll just do one marshmallow competition. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. It just fell on the ground. Where did it go? It's gone. I don't see oh, it. It disappeared. It's not here. A... And there's rolls in here for dessert. I Wait, that doesn't that. make sense. Why do you eat a roll for dessert? I don't know. Usually that's dinner. Did you want to eat a muffin? What kind of muffin? Banana nut muffin bread. Uh, sure, let's do one. Okay. No, there we go. Okay. Oh, we got to get the pudding now. We're going to try the pudding challenge. We're going to try the pudding? Oh, look at that. We got the pudding. Bing, bada, boom. How much pudding should we put? Let's see. I'm gonna get more pudding. Would you, would you, did you want to put more pudding on there? Is yeah, a little bit more. There you go. Okay, we got the puddings now. You want to do a cupcake competition? Uh, sure. Let's do it. Cupcake in there. Do you want? Did you want any uh, apple pie? Wait, what's that? What's that? Oh, is that oh, lemon? I think key lime pie. That's a coconut cream. A yeah. coconut? Oh, coconut cream. Do you want any of that? Yeah, let's do that. Here, let's get some of this for you. Shoot. <laughs> Here you go. What's that? That's not even a slice. <laughs> Again, you want a carrot cake? Nah, I'm good on that one. I think okay. I'm going to get more of okay. the rest of that. Okay guys, we're going to go get some ice cream now. I don't got hands for my ice cream. How about we do this first and we come back when it's slower? Yeah. Somebody asked if we have outtakes for videos. I don't think we do that, right? Yeah, you know like bloopers? Sometimes. Okay. Do you want to... Okay, what did you want to do first? You want to do the marshmallow? Okay. There's only a one marshmallow challenge. That's one marshmallow. The other one. I'm sorry, but the other marshmallow fell on the ground, so we're going to be doing the marshmallow challenge. You got to open your mouth when you're all done, okay? Ready? So, three, two, one, go. Oh, done. You give me a nap. You still eat them on. That's two to zero. He hasn't won the challenge yet. Okay, well, what do you want to do next? You could do the pudding? We're doing the pudding and the cupcake challenge. Which, Which one? one? Uh, what do you want to do first? I need a spoon. I don't have a spoon. The spoons are outside. Oh, boy. You got to go get them. Do you want to use your forks? I'm gonna use the pork I was using for food. I can go get some spins. We are back. All right, he's gonna go get right. some You can talk. All right, while he's while he's gone, uh, I have another voice. Uh, All talk. right. Hey Peter, let's play some Fortnite together. <laughs> We're really sick. <laughs> Supposed to be Joe Swanson from Family Guy. 
the heck? There's some sauce on it. There's some sauce on your spoon. <laughs> <laughs> Is you still want it? No. I'm, I think I'll take it. It's fine. It's a spoon. It's all wet. The spoon. That is weird. Wait, did, didn't you check the spoons? Oh, it's over there. I just grabbed it in the, the spoon container. Oh, you want to hand me? Can you hand me a napkin, please? All right, it's pudding time. You're gonna lose. All right, I gotta wipe the spoon down. You wanna wipe your spoon down? I did. I, it's still on there. I, I'm oh. fine with that. Man, they didn't do a good job, job of dishwashing this. Oh, at least they ain't on the spoon itself. Yeah, that would be really bad. I could eat so much germs. <laughs> All right. Okay. Would you say mine is equal to his? Mine might be a little bit more bigger. No, they look about the same. All okay, right. ready? You do a countdown from five. No. Five, four, three, two, one, go! I think I'm done. He, he went, he's beat you by like a second. Dang it. By a second only. Good job, dude. Three Ugh. to zero. Three to zero. Okay, what else? Let's see. The cupcake, right? That was the last one. And then we're the, the cupcake. Cream. Then we're going to do the ice cream after. Wait, should we open it or like yeah, have the challenge have we have to Yeah, open it up. How's my face? Get it ready to eat. Hey guys, is my face clean? Looks clean. I think okay. it's going to be late, so we're probably not going to get your messages until later. Are you guys ready? Okay. Alright, I'm ready, but Three. part of it fell off. Wait, wait. Are you ready? You're not ready yet. His freaking the cupcake's falling apart. Does that count if he has like <laughs> half of a cupcake? <laughs> That's G, look at this cupcake. <laughs> Maybe give him a chance. <laughs> give him a chance. Give him a fair chance. Okay, guys. Give him, a, give him a handy. Three, yeah. two, one, go! I think he beat you. <laughs> you know how you got me? Yeah. I feel angry. Got me? You weren't even close. I can't. He's just too freaking fast. <coughs> I don't know. Man. His fast speed, man. He's fast. <laughs> Someone says, John, you gotta step your game up, Blow. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't doing so good. That's more to zero. You gotta learn to swallow fast. Maybe on the ice cream challenge, well, I'll get a huge brain freeze like last time, and hey, I'll maybe let you I can catch come, up. Maybe I can come back on the ice cream. Yeah. We'll see what happens. That gives you one shot. We got a uh, Rice Krispie. I'm gonna try it. <laughs> this virus wins, somebody said. Yes. I don't think I ever seen it this busy here on Monday. Have you? No, it is very busy for Monday. I mean, it is spring break though. That oh. could be why. Yeah. Spring break for for. Uh, Oh, maybe for well, most schools except for um, college because college was last late two weeks ago. Yeah, I last week. Okay. Yeah. What was that? That was. was uh, I don't know what that. He, the coconut guys, pie. Yeah, but coconut is it cream. is it coconut? I'm gonna check. We are spoken of. How's the ice cream working? Better go now, because the ice cream people are going to be over there. Okay, guys. It's ice cream. Ice 
guys. How much ice cream did you want to do? You want to fill yours up for you? Yeah, go ahead. Whatever you did is a good amount. Man, that's more than yours. I'll add mine a little bit. Yeah, you gotta put more on yours, dude. Well, that's not mine. Is that what? Yeah. No. There we go. No. What's your guys' favorite ice cream flavor? Yeah, Strawberry huh? cheesecake or cookie dough for me? The cookie dough is pretty good, but like a blizzard. Okay, guys. Okay, we're gonna do a countdown from five, four, three, two, one, go. Oh crap. You had a lot more than he did in his cup. I told him he needed to put more. Maybe he put too much. <laughs> he put way too much. He ain't even gonna come close. Brain freeze incoming. Yeah, it's incoming. All right. <laughs> Oh, I feel it. <laughs> it's like the last time. I Damn, think he I wished it on you. Oh, why did you have to comment that? What was your name? Rickon, nice job. <laughs> You're lucky I get brain freeze. Oh. I get brain freeze too. Oh. It's giving you some time. Ah, I'm getting a brain freeze. I don't remember it hurting this bad. <laughs> but the last time we did. He's going to it right now. Club <laughs> Johnny brain freeze. <laughs> You want a peep a Peter Piper pizza buffet? We did order a Peter Piper pizza buffet. Maybe we'll go to it again. What do you think? Peter Piper pizza buffet. And we were thinking about doing a Pizza Hut buffet. Because there's a Pizza Hut not that far away that has a buffet during lunchtime. So maybe we'll go live there or do a video there. So just let us know. Yeah, we gave you too much ice cream. I don't know if that was fair. Jeez, look at you, you'd still probably be me. Look at that. Look at that. That's crazy. You just ate well, all that. Well, you had you had at least a third more than he did. So what do you think? What do you think? I don't know if that one. I don't. I can strike that from the record. That one doesn't count. I don't think it'll count. No. It's still no? three. Because there's three, no way zero. for me to know exactly. I think now I'm having like a stomach freeze. A <laughs> stomach freeze? <laughs> Which Pizza Hut? It's on 48th Street and Broadway. Well, I don't know whatever street it turns into after the mountain and when you get across the freeway. I don't know what street that is. I don't know if that's still Broadway. Well, I'll have to look it up. Uh, you got you to gotta try that. Uh, you got to try the banana banana nut bread thing right there. I'm gonna go get my Oh, the muffin? Hold on. Yeah, the yeah, muffin. Okay. You guys still have those buffets in Arizona? I seen one of them, the Pizza Hut buffet over there. Okay, yeah, it is. It is 48 in Broadway. So, but yeah, yeah it's uh, I ate there one time before. It is pretty good. 
guys still have those? You got to come. Easy? You got to come between eleven. You got to come between eleven and two p.m. No, yep. not. Wait. You no, no, no. Eleven and eleven a.m. to two p.m. Jerry, you don't have so, a you don't have a Pizza Hut buffets in Texas. That sucks. So. But how's that banana the banana nothing thing? I think Wendy's used to have buffets. What? Yeah, they had a salad buffet. Damn, that's crazy. How's that muffin? Mm, How is that? That's kind of all right. Uh, it's all right. Yeah. What about this thing right there? Oh, uh, that was the coconut thing. Did we already do that one already? Uh... I think we did, yeah, but I'll do it again. Just He's trying the coconut pie. That's good. That's good. good. Hold on, I need to grab some more. I think, is it spring break for uh, elementary school? I think yeah. it's elementary, middle school, or high school. I think, I'm not sure, because there's. We're not cold. Because it's very busy for a Monday. There's a lot of people. So. But, yeah. <laughs> you want to try some of it? You have some food. You're not eating this, right? You eating anything? I was, I was trying the banana, banana muffin. Let me try it more. Banana bread muffin, I think. It's not bad, it's cold, which is fine with the muffin. You're all out of jelly. Oh, oh no. Yep. That's not bad. Probably like a 7 out of 10. Oh, I forgot to say, I forgot to say what I would rate the freaking, uh, uh, what would you, what would you rate dessert. The, uh, the dessert. Uh, mm, probably a six. It's good, but it's kind of kind of cheap. Let me let me check if they have cotton candy. Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Do you want any cotton candy if they have any? Nah, I'm good. Do they have any cotton candy up there? I didn't see any. This is what uh, this is what you got. You got Jello. He's eating a cookie right now. You got a uh, pudding, and then you got a chocolate chip cookie. Yeah, chocolate chip cookie's great. The Jello's great, except they ran out of Jello. Oh, they ran out of Jello. That's right. He got so little. That's here. a little Jello. And, and that's had pudding. Things. Pudding is very good too. Yeah. Mm. Yep. The pudding is a nine. Pudding is a nine? Yeah, you have to have the cooked pudding. I love the cooked pudding. Once you cook the pudding, it gets that hard top when it's in the refrigerator. Oh, the skin? Oh, I love that. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Delicious. I'm How's spoiled. The, I'm sorry. How is the cookie? Cookie's great. Tastes like a cookie. Whoa. Cool. Tastes oh, really good. It tastes, tastes like good. a cookie. <laughs> it doesn't taste crappy. Let's put it that way. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if it was a crappy cookie, you know, disgusting. It tastes like a good cookie. So, comment below, have you guys ate at the Golden Corral Buffet, and tell me what you think of the Golden Corral Buffet. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Do you want to go back again to it? Let me know in the comments. Uh, apparently the freaking Pizza Hut buffets are disappearing. I agree with that. They're leaving. Yeah, if, you, there's a, if there's a Pizza Hut buffet near you, I would go, you know, give it, you know, get an experience out of it. I don't think they have the salad in the buffet. What was that kid's buffet that was over there that time? The CeCe's buffet? Was it CeCe's? Yeah, there's no, I don't think there's any more CeCe's buffets anymore. Yeah, they disappeared. Yeah, we did a video. Oh, yeah, the abandoned one. Yeah, so that was interesting. How about the one with the... Uh, the piano, the uh, organ stuff. Yeah, organ stuff. That's not a buffet. No, it's a pizza joint. It's a pizza joint, but it's not but a buffet. It's, it's for fun, you know. Yeah. It's kind of like a buffet. You can order what you want. It's uh, not where you serve yourself. Yeah, I was there on the last day of the guy that retired from playing the organ. Oh really? Yeah, I have a. 
I think I have a video on uh, my channel, actually. Nice, Ryan. That's cool. If you want to go again to the Golden Corral. Oh, it's on my other channel. Dang it. Yeah, Oregon Stop, right? Yeah, oh, Oregon, Oregon Stop. Stop. Have you guys heard of Oregon Stop Pizza? There's also a uh, over by there's a buffet pizza buffet over off of Gilbert Road and Southern. It's called Pizza Factory, and they have a buffet there. Thinking about maybe doing a video there, and then a video at the Mountain Mike's buffet, the pizza buffet, and then there's also Pizza Hut, and then there's also uh, uh, Peter Piper Pizza. Oh, uh, that was like two years. I can't believe it's been two years, bro. Wow. Oh, September 10th of 2021 when the guy retired. Oh, yeah. I it, was, it was just, yeah, I remember it was just right. yesterday. It felt like it. <laughs> Time flies and you have it. Yeah. That's crazy. You can put song requests in for the organ. Yeah, it's so cool. Did you do any requests when you were no, there? No, but they had, so there was, the three of them were Star Wars, Mission Impossible, and then Let It Go from Broadway. Nice, that's cool. Those are the ones that I recorded. Yeah. I what like are Mission my... Impossible. Dude, 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 dude. I haven't seen I the newest one. I watched all the Mission Impossible. They, they just came out with another one, I think. Hey, I almost went to work for the CIA. They were they have their office up in the city court building in the slant. That's where the communication center is. They wanted me to go work there. I told them I, I like Mission Impossible, but they had morals. Yeah. And I don't think our government has morals present. So till they do, I wouldn't work for them. I went to work for the phone company. AT and T. Yeah. I spent 36 years there doing electronics. I went to Polytechnic Institute in Brooklyn, 333 J Street. If you guys know any other buffets, uh, that would be great. If you can comment down below that we can do. Oh yeah, for Daniel L. Retail. What do you think about them demolishing the Fiesta Mall? That was very sad. Yes. And like almost cried when Saddest they destroyed it. Saddest day in history. Yeah. Of Arizona. Yeah, I love going to that mall. Well, you guys grew up going to that mall. Oh yeah. 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 I got I went when I went to the Fiesta Mall. I got my picture taken in the Sears. Remember that? Yes. Yeah. So that was crazy now there's nothing it's all gone yeah so I did do a few videos at the I mean I went in a little bit but not much just in that barbershop but now that barbershop's across the street at the other place now so but oh he can, moved yeah over right over by the Jack in the Box over by Mesa Community College oh that's crazy so but yeah I love going to that mall I, my sister used to work in that mall I forgot. I think that was cool. I think she worked in Forever 21 or something like that back in the day. And she would park down at the bottom of the, you know, there's like a two-story It was very park. sad losing that mall. She yeah. went, she parked down below. So, and I can remember that eating at that uh, Japanese place. That was pretty good. Sarchu or something like that. That was good. Um, let's see. And just walking the mall. I remember they had the Just Sports over there. Oh, they did? They had a Just Sports in there, and I got a Mets lanyard there. So, but that was when it was dying, too. And there was a guy at Sears that said that he thought, he's like, oh, Sears isn't going to close. And then, like, a few months later, it began the liquidation for Sears. So... And I remember too, not that far, probably like eight miles away from there, they had the Kmart down there. I went to the Kmart down there, and basically they had a uh, they had the little Caesars in there, and we got a four dollar hot and ready pizza. So that was a great deal. I didn't even know it was four dollars back then. No, it was. Uh, I 
I guess it was basically like the food, the pizza was wasn't sold for a little bit, maybe like 40 minutes, and then he asked, I can give you this pizza for four dollars, so I'm like, yeah, sure, I'll watch pizza. Wait, at Kmart? Yeah, Kmart. They sell, they sell pizza? They used to have a little Caesars in Kmart. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. It was four bucks? Yeah, four dollars. Now it's like seven dollars and fifty cents. Yeah, it's a rip-off. Stupid inflation. I remember when it was five bucks. Yep. It was like, it used to be like five dollars and like twenty cents. And then it just keeps going up and up everything. Like now, at Subway, a tuna sub is over ten dollars. And if you want to get it with a combo, you got to pay four more dollars for chips and drink. That is a ripoff right there. Even with the coupon still, it's very expensive. I can remember not that long ago, it was like five dollars. Wait, which Kmart did you go to? That somebody the, asked. The Kmart that I went to was over by Superstition Springs Mall. Yeah, that's the that's the one they were talking about. And now they tore down that Kmart. Now there's apartments there, so it sucks. But there's only one good thing around there. And basically, the Long John Silver's is over there, so that's Long John Silver's is good every once in a while, but not eat it all the time. So very greasy. Uh, did you ever eat Long John Silver's? Did you ever go? Ooh, I'm, I don't think I have. That's fish. I don't like ocean food. How about that? I didn't want to say seafood because you were gonna make the joke again. <laughs> I don't like you ocean seafood, food. You eat it? <laughs> there he goes again. <laughs> Couldn't help but you asked for it. That's why it's that ocean food. Would you go to the Pacific Seafood Buffet? Mm, no, because it's all ocean. <laughs> now I can't say it around him, because he's going to say it again. You could, <laughs> you'd never make it on a boat, I guess. No, because I would die because I couldn't catch a fish. I learned to catch fish on the ocean. The Atlantic Ocean. Yeah. We'd go out on the ship and go fishing. Really yeah. nice. Pick some big fish up there. Hey, you let your ice cream, it's basically like liquid now. Yeah. You could drink that. Yeah, that ice cream is not top quality. That's cheap ice cream. I can tell. Man, I can't, That's I can't, not believe, like I can't ice believe you can get cheaper than McDonald's ice cream. That's a soft serve, but this is a, a, a mush. Yeah, I can't believe you can get cheaper than McDonald's ice cream. And that is cheaper than McDonald's. That's crazy. That's almost like 90% ice. And the machines are broke every time you go. <laughs> They're never fixed, man. Yeah. It's crazy. So, let's see, what else? What would you guys like to know about this Pyrus and Johnny Vlogs? Please, do, what? Somebody said, please don't eat my Pizza Hut Cafe. Who are you talking to? Pizza. Sounds like you're talking to Queso. Get out of here. Eat People make fun of him all the time because they're like, please don't eat me. He, like, they're, they're making fun of like his weight, but he's Even not really like that, that guy who says, get in my belly. No, <laughs> not that guy. What's his, what's his name again? Oh, fat bastard, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not that guy, I swear. Are there any more comments? Uh, not any new ones. Uh, Daniel says he misses the old Pizza Hut Express at the Target stores. Oh yeah, let me tell you something about the Targets. Basically, I used we used to go to Target like every Tuesday back in the day, and then we rarely go there. We only go there maybe like once every few months. So they used to have the food cafe over there, which had the chicken strips, chicken tenders, pizza, hot dogs, hot dogs popcorn, pretzels, all the good stuff. And they had ice cream too, I remember back then. But now, based, a lot of uh, Targets now are basically, they're either with Starbucks, Starbucks, which is very expensive. I don't, Yeah. the last time I had Starbucks with, was I got a lemonade there, it was like a ripoff. How much was it? I think it was like five something, with oh, five just a bucks? lot of ice. 
Like, how big was the cup? Probably about like... Like, it's smaller or bigger than that? Probably about that size. That size? That's late. Yeah. So, but that was that was a rip-off right there. Um, and then also, now, they use it for pickup, which which sucks. Yeah, you can refill it for free. So what the heck you talking about? Not, not, you can't refill it for free in Starbucks. So. In Target? Yeah. No, I was saying the Starbucks when they had oh, the Oh, the Starbucks? Yeah. Forget it. Yeah. So, yeah. it the was a rip-off. They had a machine you could just go up and get it. So, I love the Target when they had the neon lights. I actually went to a Target probably like eight years ago. You went in there, it was like back in the 90s. Like basically, when you went in there, it was like neon lights, old signage. It was really awesome. Now it's a storage place. It's like, come on, man. Uh, so. Some, so people start asking questions. Someone asked, what happened to the hot dog suit? I do have a hot dog suit. I was thinking of uh, doing a video where I go to some hot dog places. Oh, yeah? And just and just dressing up in a hot dog suit? Or walk in a downtown Tempe or something with a hot dog costume and see people's reactions. Just let me know also what you guys want me to do with the hot dog costume outfit. So, you know, I'm open to these ideas. So... Oh yeah, I don't know if you guys saw, but I'm wearing a new Johnny Block shirt. It's not new anymore, I got food on it. That's <laughs> <laughs> brand new when you started. Hey, when I started it was brand new, but... <laughs> Thanks again for the shirt. Yeah, Great no shit. Another question somebody asked, what got you guys to start making YouTube videos? Um... I guess you can go first. I don't know. Well, no, it's just basically I felt like... I've been watching all these YouTube videos and it's like people are having a fun time and I'm like, I need to have a fun time. I need to have fun. I need to go out and make these videos. And I have been editing each video too, which has gotten a lot of work. So I'm trying to, I might upgrade to a different editor to make it more better. But yeah, I've been editing all my videos and uh, I just love doing this. And, you know, this is the first chance I have to go live because you can go live with more more people when you reach over a thousand subscribers. So, well, I, I mean, my friend was telling me when you get a thousand subs, then you can monetize it and make money. So, so you can go live when you have fifty subs, but you can't make money off it until you have a thousand. So, yeah. So basically, you need the thousand, and you also need four thousand watch hours. So, I am probably like almost 2,200 watch hours because it goes over 365 uh, days so if you guys can I mean it would be cool if you guys could watch more of my videos so I can get up to that 4,000 watch hours that would be great so I can travel more probably go to Las Vegas or something like that big Vegas buffet videos so I think that would be freaking awesome and maybe go to like other places so but uh yeah, that's what uh, that's what I heard and I was seeing on there. So, because I can't click that button when you get the four thousand and over a thousand uh, subscribers, you can click the button to join the community because they review your uh, YouTube videos and make sure everything's good, and then they approve you, and then uh, yeah, it'd be freaking awesome. So that's what I'm trying to get. So that would be cool, you know because I am just the poor boy right now. So, but like once I get monetized and stuff and start making money, I can go to different places. So like different states and stuff, that'd be cool. So, but what do you, what do you think? Uh, what do I think? Well, okay, so there are a couple reasons. So the first ever videos I did on my channel were they're called AMVs, which is short for anime music videos. I got stuff in my beard where right here. How does it look now? Let's see. Looks better. Okay, good. Yeah, my mustache can't catch a lot, but I used to make their anime music videos. So I'd take anime or, if you don't know, Japanese cartoon shows, and then I would put music to them, and so it would just be the music for them. And that was back when. YouTube was a lot less strict with copyright rules, so you could just get away with putting whatever song. And so I put like a couple videos, and I, I got fun with Windows Movie Maker back when it was free or whatever. And then I started doing 
game videos and oh boy <laughs> I, I think i remember johnny looking at some of the old ones that i did yeah and they're pretty cringe but i kind of just i kind of um and then i started doing uh, like uh i got into uh, uh so I, after the game videos i started doing skits on my new channel which was well, okay, it used to be it used to be Discord X Chaos and then I changed it to Disc Pyrus, which um, which I, I did gaming videos and then I did skit videos which were those Gary Mod videos which was my my uh, probably my uh, Renaissance era and that was probably my favorite era of just freaking recording myself and I, it was just all improv. I would just show up with characters like my favorite one was Rick and Morty and just roll off the whatever story came up like like one one of them was uh darth vader is working for the emperor in star wars and the emperor's like yo my weed's gone i need you to fight <laughs> and who you end up fighting at the yoda takes it and he's like the emperor's like oh crap that's my steroid weed <laughs> and then and then yoda turns into the i don't even know how i found it it's like a Hulk body with yoda's head on top of it so he's he turns into that and, and Darth Vader's like, gotta get the weapon out. And he pulls his shotgun out that just kills him in one hit. There's a, I got uh, a few comments on here. One of them, can you add the option to be able to tip you? So I have to have the 4,000 watch hours in order to do that. So, which, um, which? That would be, I mean, that would be great. But right now, I need to get the rest of the 4,000. That's why I've been posting a lot of videos, trying to get my numbers up for the, the watch hours. So, uh, let's see here. Somebody asked, what's your favorite video? What was our favorite video to make? What would you say? I don't know. Um, I would probably say... That's a good question. Did we? No, I don't remember. Because I remember we were trying. Did we ever go through with it where we were playing games on your PS1 one time? No. Did we do that? I don't that? think so. I'm trying to remember. Hold on. I'm I think it was on yours. Uh, Maybe that was mine. I really liked doing the Fiesta Mall videos, a few of them, which was, that was pretty awesome. Uh, because now I have memories of uh, what happened and what it looked like. So I still have those memories there. And that was pretty cool. And I also like, I would probably say, going to the Las Vegas videos too. Those were really fun. Um, let's see. I guess going to the Resorts World, that was pretty fun when it opened up. And then also, Walking around the casinos and stuff, that was pretty fun. So, seeing different things. And the video that I would say was like the scariest was probably going up to South Mountain. So, because you got your tight turns going up there in your car. So, there were some areas where like the metal pieces to the sides to hold you uh, were dented. I've heard somebody who was a park worked for Park and Recreations over there. She said that a few times people actually jumped off of the mountain with their car. That's crazy stuff. So, let's see here. I don't know, I don't have a, I think honestly this live has been my favorite thing to ever record. <laughs> it's just me dying laughing, but. The video, the video I think that I got the most attention on was, remember when I was doing the freaking New York voice? Well, that. That was my character, Don Mikey Rigatoni, where he was just... Rigatoni? Yeah, his, name, his last name's Rigatoni. <laughs> I eat Rigatoni. What are you talking about? Have you, That's good stuff. Have you, know? you went to Boston Market before? I have. It's been a while, though. They closed all of their locations in AZ, but there's only one left, which is in near the Quinsock and Sutherland. Uh, you, we usually go to that one over there, but... Uh, that one's been open for a really long time, too. Yeah. But it's been a while since I've been there. Do you guys review beer too? What? <laughs> no, I don't. No, we don't, don't drink. Yeah, I don't. I don't drink. I could drink root beer. 
but yeah. That's well, I mean, you're out of soda, so you, yeah, you can't drink. I don't drink. Beer. I haven't drank a soda in about six months, so which is good. Yeah, it's very good. So, so yeah, I don't, I don't drink beer. So. Oh boy, sorry guys. But yeah. I replay the South Mountain video often because it's so nice and relaxing. Well, thank you, Mariah. Really appreciate that. Watching the South Mountain video. So, and then that helps me get me one step closer to the 4,000 watch hours. So. Some guy earlier said try donut burgers. Donut burgers? That no. does sound interesting. We do have a Krispy Kreme Sounds donuts gross. place. Not I know. Why would you want to eat a donut and a burger? Oh, a burger with a donut? Inside? Yeah, like like the, the bread being made up donut. Oh, man. Yeah, oh. that sounds nasty. Yeah. But, let's see. They just don't, don't go together. Let's see here. Do you guys have any? Spring Mall is starting to become Fiesta Mall. There's a couple of vacant stores there. Yeah, I've noticed that during the week for Superstition Mall, it's pretty dead in there. A lot of some of the, like the subway's not there anymore. And then there's the Detroit Coney Island uh, restaurant not there anymore. But like on the weekends, it's it gets pretty busy. But like all the other days, it's pretty slow. And a lot of places closed around there, like that Old Country Buffet, that closed down quite a while ago so the hair salon closed there too yeah there's a hair salon there and that's closed so that's nothing over there and i guess when the sears left and like other anchor stores leave that means it starts to the mall starts to go downhill unfortunately i mean i like that mall too but it's like a good distance away probably like 20 miles away yeah it's pretty But yeah, I've been there a few times in the Old Country Buffet too. Let's see, did y'all hear that they were going to reopen the Zoli's? And if they would, you do a video there. So, the Fazoli's is at Mesa Riverview. I passed, it used to be an Arby's. What is, what is that? I've never been there. It's like an Italian fast food. Oh, place. like, like, kind of like, 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 kind of like Olive Garden to go. Do they have the pizza? I'm not sure, but. They have like spaghetti and stuff? making a video over there. I haven't tried Pizzoli's before, so we'll see what happens. We had the meats. <laughs> we had the meats. <laughs> yeah, no meats anymore. <laughs> no meats at Arby's anymore. Yeah, that one, that one was closed. They two over there. So, and there was another place. There was, um, over there and then they open it to a seafood place which sounds very expensive so they had wings pizza cookies cheesecakes and more there at Fazoli's that's cool oh, that's cool nice so maybe we have to try it if you guys know any other buffet places around here around Arizona that we can try that would be great I'm trying I was trying to look them up on there I was thinking about going to Casino Arizona Buffet, trying that one, see how that one looks, looks pretty fancy, so, but, you know, we'll see what, see what happens. Angry Crab Shack? No, that's, what? Isn't that called Joe's Crab Shack? There is, there is a Joe's Crab Shack in an Angry Crab Shack. Oh. So, I went to Joe's Crab Shack over by Arizona Mills Mall in Tempe. That place is very expensive. They used to have one on McClintock and Southern. Southern. Yeah. McClintock and Southern used to have one. Now that's a car wash. Oh, that's what that. Oh, right. Yeah, I like going there. Um, this, oh, yeah. So, but yeah, it's been crazy. Or at least it used to be there. I don't know if it's there anymore. Is it still there? Uh, yeah, it's still there. Yeah. There used to be a... Uh, 
I think another steak joint over there. They demolished it. Now there's nothing over there. So let's see. Yeah, that's now not a sushi place. Yeah, okay. that's a sushi place now. Sweet tomatoes. So we did a film. We did that video there. Sweet yeah. tomatoes. So. We would probably do a video if there's a buffet, you know, if that place was still open, so, but not anymore. No, it's been so, out for years. Yeah. So, Your ice cream. It's yeah. liquid. You can drink that now. Yeah, let me see if I can drink this ice cream. Yo, Nick Knack, you are funny, dude. Oh, if you're not a dude, sorry. Your ice cream is not melting. Not assuming your gender. Yes, it is melting. Let me see. We're dudes. Yeah, I, do, I, do, I use dude as a, as a non-gender specific term. <laughs> We're dudes. We're men. If you guys... I, where should I go live next? That would be great. Is the Sweet Tomatoes location opening? to the Mimi's Cafe or by the mall there. That mall was pretty cool. So, and there is all of, yeah. Yeah, that mall's awesome. So, Their Animal Kingdom store is so huge. It's like, it's like three or four times the size of ours at Arizona Mills Mall. Yeah. That's the best store. They had like a, they had like a bulldog running around. He had his own like, like it was caged, but he had his own huge area where he had like freaking like playground equipment. I'm like, bro, this guy's living a life. What? Yeah. Let's see. Stop messages. So what else would you like to... Anybody else like to know anything else about Johnny Blogs? Yeah, or Dispires. You can ask anything. It's uh, Ask Question Central. Question and answer. Do you think you'll come out with merchandise? I'd buy it. So, basically... I will after I get monetized, so they can, I can, then I can start opening like a, a shop thing that they have. So I gotta wait until I get monetized, you know, I'm trying to get there. So little by little, I, I hope that some of the videos I have up will go viral. So I think that would be a good, a good thing, so that way I can get there quicker and uh, yeah, that would be great. But they need to make some Johnny Vlog statues. <laughs> Johnny, why the hot dog? So I used to own a, a hot dog cart back in the day, probably about, what would you say, like five, four years ago. I sold hot dogs in downtown Phoenix. And it was called Johnny Super. Brett's, yeah. Yeah, Johnny Real Super. New York dogs. Yeah, Johnny Super Hot Dogs. I sold New York hot dogs, the best hot dogs. So basically, and I did. I uh, sold them at schools too, so but like it, business wasn't as great, so but I decided to start my YouTube channel and have a hot dog because hot dogs are cool. Like a hot dog, cool dude guy, with a backwards cap and some sunglasses on. So but yeah, hot dogs are good to eat too. So good stuff. Is the Determinator coming back? There's a question. So, determine is the Determinator coming back? Uh, that's, I think that was like my first few videos. I did a Determinator. So, I mean, I don't think I can change the name of my profile thing. Looks like I like the Johnny Vlogs. Um, maybe I'll open another YouTube channel once I get monetized. Stuff, have two channels. Maybe call that one to Determinator. We'll see what happens. So, but for right now, I'm. Uh, everybody knows Johnny Vlogs, so I'm sticking with the Johnny Vlogs. Let's see. I also tried their Chizza and at KFC, and it was okay, but it was expensive in my opinion. Yeah, it was like thirteen dollars for a meal. With the drink and the fries, that was a ripoff. For a little bit more, you can go to Olive Garden and get a uh, chicken parmesan. So, but 
Yeah, it's very expensive. I thought when you said the Terminator, you were talking about the Terminator. The Terminator. Tire. Tire. Robot from the future. Thank you, Juliet. AI dangerous. I had I had to say John Connor. John Connor, yes. <laughs> Do you have any more expressions? Uh, impressions? Impressions? Oh, uh, we could be here for a while. <laughs> yeah. Are we gonna go? So let me uh, is the time on it. It's been like almost two hours. It's two yeah, hours. Yeah, we've been here two minute? hours. Oh. I think you just about had it now. Yeah. Okay, but yeah, just uh, yeah, just comment down below if see what other videos I should do or I should go live. Uh, it doesn't always have to be food videos. I mean, we can go to a bu another buffet or something. We can go live again. But just let me know. I think that would be uh, that'd be cool because you know, trying to go viral. So if they like to see live videos, so then yeah, I can, apparently they do. Then I can have my merchandise up there, so for sale. <laughs> Someone says I can watch you all night. Thank you. <laughs> well, thank you. That's that, awesome. that would get me closer to the moniz monetization because I need the four thousand watch hours. So, but. Well, yeah, is there anything else you wanted uh, to say? Um, I mean, I might, I might go back and start because I have a, I have a couple series I'm gonna play. I might go back to playing Kingdom Hearts Two, critical, uh, which is the hardest mode on level one, which is the hardest way you can play it. So I might go back to playing that because I finished a certain section and the next section I'm in is going to be crazy. So I might upload, I, I, I'll probably, I'll probably tomorrow maybe, but I have two Just Pirates channels. So one of them has, um, I think that, are they both named the same name? Give me a second. Let me just make sure. While he's looking, um, shoot, what was I going to say? Yeah, oh. they're both the same day, but um, one of them, okay, one of them has a at Dispirus one, and the other one has just a Dispirus. You can tell because the one that I'm actually on only has 30 subs, so please sub to that channel. I lost my other channel because Google decided they don't have a customer support system, so there's no way I can fix it. So please, I need 50 subs to go live. That would be cool if you guys could watch me play games and stuff. Yeah. Um, subscribe to his channel. But if you could tell your friends, family, relatives, people at work, everybody, if you guys can subscribe and if you can have them watch my uh, videos, that would be awesome. So, but yeah, just uh, just let me know also what video, other videos I should do. Yeah, we might pizza hut buffet or something next yeah. time oh yeah, live so. maybe live yeah pizza hut buffet or so maybe go to the casino arizona buffet so but yeah yeah subscribe to dispires and subscribe to johnny blocks everybody yeah and we appreciate all the people who have subscribed already thanks for thanks for watching this was a lot of fun yeah we had too much fun we'll do more videos here soon and uh yeah, so thank you very much. God bless. And when I get to uh, probably like 10,000 subscribers, let's say, then I'll probably uh, do another raffle. So I think or maybe I'll, you want to make it smaller. Maybe maybe another thousand. Two thousand. I'll let I'll let you guys know. So, but uh, just trying to get to that four thousand watch hour. So, but thank you very much, guys. God bless. You guys have a good rest of your night. And so, remember. Oh, uh, one more thing somebody guys. asks. Do you have any other social medias where we can follow you guys? Um, so I will. Uh, I'll comment that down below. Um, so, but yeah, appreciate you guys. Thank you very much. And more freaking awesome videos to come. So thank you and God bless. Thanks. Peace out. Jalen, no, no.